Hey, 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 what's going on, everyone? Hey, you see the console coming to you live for a little more Shadow Hearts Covenant. In the last episode, we escaped the Ronda Mine and we made it all the way to Wales. However, before going to Wales, I want to go ahead and go do a little pit start, pit, yeah, pit start, pit stop back in the have. And you know, I've been passing up on buying accessories for the characters all this time. For this battle, I'm actually going to want to go ahead and buy some. Specifically. I want to buy the Bodhi bracelets. So I currently have two in the inventory. One's equipped. So let's just go buy two more here, shall we? Try for that 20% discount, get some points along the way. I'm down with that. Yeah, I got ourselves 48 more points. Sweet. All right, so Yuri's got it equipped. Karen, we're gonna give you the Bodhi bracelet. Joakim, send Leo Beard, switch that out. And for you, Blanca, don't need the pocket watch, put the buddy bracelet on. So the way I'm going to play the game for the most part is I'm always going to have a belt, a cap, and then an accessory. And sometimes it has, the accessory really won't matter at a point in time, just because it's just like, eh, I need something equipped on me. The upcoming baddies won't be doing too much to me that I need to worry about, but for this battle, Coming up in a little while, yeah, we're going to want to make sure we have, uh, what am I doing? Go back without saving? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I just got so, so excited being in saving mood, I guess. But anyways, let's go on, head off to Wales, see what happens. Maybe, maybe we'll figure, we'll run into bacon, reminisce a little bit. What's going on? We're in Wales, girl. We already told you. Oh yeah. The Nemeton Monastery. We remember that place. And all the puzzles we had to face there. Ugh. Six months ago, I thought this was all a year ago. This is where it all began, and it all ended. And we get scenes from the first game. Six nice. Ago, oh. There was a man who tried to destroy the world. I like the kitty art during this. It's pretty he awesome. Raised a temple into the sky and summoned a god from beyond the stars. Yeah, he had a flea face. I remember that. To remake the world in his own image. Hmm. We defeated what a jerk. Him and battled the god. That's right. We whooped his ass. In the end, we were saved by a legendary magician who has lived for a thousand years. Roger Bacon. Oh, the Bacon Man. We originally thought Albert Simon was the Bacon Man, but later on in the game, found out there was a spoiler that wasn't him after all. I should say more plot twist. Seal of life up here. So let's head on down the hills, shall we, and see what we got coming up. And we'll just keep running, just keep running. Huh. Look at that house there with the heart in there. I wonder if it's still got the fancy animation where the heart lights up when the door opens. Oh, Ring Soul! Huh? I am the Ring Soul, the will of the Judgment Ring, the administer of all fate. Yuri's switching it up. That's who you are, right? Oh, now you're clucking your tongue at us. What a jerk. But we get ourselves an attack boost out of it. Power to command the Judgment Ring, it'll help you carve your way through destiny, blah blah blah. Yeah, seriously, there's no pizzazz in this at all. Come on. You're going to see if we're truly the one to command it. Okay, bye. Huh? <laughs> Someone sounds a little mopey. So after that, let's customize our ring a little bit. So Yuri has four, Karen four, Joaquin three. Yeah, I'm going to give him the other attack. And then for the hit area width, the second one seems pretty low. So let's just up that a little bit. All right, now that we talked to the soul ring there. If you follow this path to the east a little bit, which looks like we're going south. Uh, but yeah, here we go. Make the turn. Open up this treasure. There's also a hit area expand. That'll actually go ahead and be beneficial for Joakim even more. So let's go ahead and give that again to the second one. Just expand that a bit more. Why not? And now let's head towards the house. But before we enter it, using the stairs there. If you look right over here, there's treasure chest. Oh man, that makes it tough with all like the, the brown ground and you got the brown chest and all kind of 
all blends in together, but we found it. All is good. So let's go into this funky looking casa and see what up. Yeah, Geppetto jealous much? Sheesh. Change into something? What, what, what would it change into? Come on, exactly. Too many fairy tales and all that good stuff. Roger, where are you at? This looks like your son right here, you know? Yuri, after all our travels. Um, Bacon? You around here? Hmm, maybe he's downstairs somewhere. I can get downstairs, damn. Let's check this floor out for a little bit, shall we? See what's going on. Bacon! Oh, he, oh yeah, he was a lotto master in the last game, so kind of it makes sense for him to have a lotto ticket. Hey, a Fornius crest. All right, yeah, make sure to check up here to get yourself the next crest. And let's go ahead and for Joaquin, let's give him another crest for good measure. What does he have? So he's got barrier, earth, air, mirage, hail. You need some fire in your life. And then Blanca, what do you have equipped on you, buddy boy? Gale Cure, Gale uh, Aqua Edge, Surge, Shield, and then this one here has Gale. Okay, so you already have Gale. Do you have Gale here, girl? No, you don't. So let's go ahead and give you this, Karen. You can take Salos. Alright, well, that's kind of peculiar. We've run around the house, haven't run into Bacon Man or anything. Hmm. Well, just to be on the safe side, let's save our progress here you know who, who knows what type of nonsense we might be running into in the near future so they clearly they must have this here for a reason all right so let's if I don't get stuck on the walls all the time so let's, uh, let's head down here let's see what's going on doesn't appear that he's here maybe he's out for you know getting some coffee or hanging out went for a walk yeah Maybe. Hmm. Well, maybe if we walk around out here, maybe we'll run into him. I mean, that's the only thing, only person I think we could run into. Yep. All's closed. What? Oh, jeez. He found us. No, oh, don't sound so scared, Geppetto. There he is. Muscles Magoo. It's just like Nikolai said. Of course. And Nikolai's always flapping his gums. What else is new? Where is he? This time he's in a oh. Cage far away. oh, what the hell? Well, you remember that scene earlier on in the game when you saw when we saw this big baddie and he had uh, that old creature on his shoulder? Well, that was Roger Bacon. Well, I got him all locked up. What a jerk. Damn you, Lenny. You'll pay for this. Only if we could figure out where exactly Bacon Man is. Oh, get your minions out of here. We ain't scared of them. We ain't scared of you. Oh, yeah. Get him, Yuri. Let's just stare down. I can't tell you. Come on. You know you want to tell us. I know, all right. And where? I'm not saying. I knew it. You got no idea. Yeah. I told you, you little punk. I do know. Prove it. I don't think you do. I think right. I think you're bluffing us. Really? I do know, really. No, you don't. Don't you lie to us. Yeah, right. It's true. It's true. It's <laughs> in Italy. Oh. Whoopsies. Oh, uh, well. That's good, good info to know. Thanks a lot, guy. We'll be on our way now. You take care. Bye-bye. Oh, Lenny. Keeping it real like always. I'm so stupid, though. Frank, stop right there. What? You what? Me? Why are you telling us to stop? No, we're just slowly walking away. Because we really don't want to have to whoop your ass. Exactly. What do you need now, guy? Me. You get their little hissy fit, huh? Now you know too much for your own good. 
Oh, okay, I guess Lenny wants to throw down, so we'll go ahead and throw down with the big guy. Alright, so let's go ahead here and with Karen. As you can see here, he's got some Claude Commander buddies hanging around here. Let's focus on them first, just to get them out of the equation. Nice. One shot. I love that. Or at least one round, I should say. And then for Yuri here, let's go to get the pretty, pretty Barbarella. Yeah, Muscles Magoo. Let's get some rage flowing in those veins. Nice. I oh, almost missed that one. But attack power increased to 36. I'll take that. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and just get a little soul comment going on here to the claw commander. Let's just put him out of his misery as soon as we can. This should hopefully take care of him real quick. Oh, it didn't do it. Damn it. Alright, let's go ahead then. Joke Noah. You know what you need to do. The, the Hogan boot. That's it for him. Now the reason I want to go ahead and equip all those Bodhi bracelets was for that reason right there, because if you're not careful, old Lenny can paralyze you. But with those bracelets equipped, th that attack is useless. So, in the meantime, let's go ahead and pair up with Joe Keem, shall we? Do a little combo action. And who's going to start us off? Old Joe Keem, huh? Yeah, just do your physical attacks, whatever. Should be no big deal either way. Keep the combo going. 35 damage. I'll go to Blanca next. Blanca, go ahead and hit a little Soul Comet, shall you? Perfect. Keep the combo alive. And here come our Double Wolves. 1-2. 33 damage. The Barbaria. I'll do a hard hit on you, why not? combo alive. And now that we got the upped offense, man, that's some good damage right there. Let's go ahead and do a little combo magic. Uh, I don't know what this one does yet, so let's go and find out, shall we? Hopefully this will deal some decent damage. Fire! Nice! We've already done 360 damage to this guy. He only has a little over 500, or eh, pretty close to 600 actually, but still not, not too far off. Hmm, I can't really do too much here before Lenny's turn, as you can see up there, based on the turn priority. So let's just go ahead and just get some attacks in on him, some solid attack. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Fury! With two misses? You kidding me? Damn it. That sucks. Oh well, we'll get, we'll get a good soul comet in here. A little soul cop from Super Bon Bon and deal some more decent damage to him. 76, not bad. Oh man, Lenny's got to be getting tired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Combo it up. Well, in the meantime, combo it up. Now we're going to be comboing up, I should say. So it's Joakim's turn. Uh, we want to combo with Blanca. I'm looking like, why has Joakim got two turns? Oh well. Combo it up with Blanca. Just keep repeating. Yeah, I know you got your turn again. Just stay where you're at. You're fine. And Blanca, do nothing. Blanca, go ahead, do your soul coughing. Perfect. I mean, I don't even know if we're going to have everyone, have the opportunity for everyone to get an attack, but it's worth a shot. Alright, Barbaria. Let's just go ahead and get our hits in. And one shot is all he needed at that point. And Lenny is toast. Beautiful. 73 extra experience. Ooh. Some decent soul points out of that too. All right. I'll check that out. All of our main party members leveled up. Awesome. I'll take that faux show. All right. It's time for us to get the heck on out of here. Damn it. It sucks to be you, guy. This close to beating us, you were nowhere near that guy. Yeah, you want to be starting something? Oh, sissy boy, gotta be running away like that. Look at the time, you whooped my ass, blah, blah, blah. 
I don't know about that, Lenny. I mean, the way we just demolished you right there, mm, I don't know how much of a chance you really got against us. Let's see what's going to happen now in the meantime. Hmm? Huh? What an astonishing performance. Who's... Quite impressive. Yes. Who the hell is this guy? Were you watching us the whole time? There. Who are you? Who are you? Seriously, who's this weasel looking guy? It's nice moustache. My name is Thomas. I'm what you might call an explorer. Um, okay. Not with the secret society? With the what? Oh, 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 heavens no. Uh, I don't trust this guy. This is someone we could probably stay away from, jeez. something about what's going on between you and them. How do you know that? You got yourself a little book here? This. What's this? What's this? What's that one of them, Encyclopedia Britannicus? Oh, it's a picture film. Hmm, what's going on in there? That's Lenny. Lenny. And he's got Roger. So, we're too late. Oh, damn it! Just like we had talked to what I'd said earlier from that earlier scene in the game, we saw now, Lenny taking him away. When I say I'm not working with them, I don't know if you're still a, if you're a stooge you or not. This? Yeah, why'd you show us this? Well, my boy. I've also got a grudge to settle what? with Sapientis Gladio. How do you know Sapientis Gladio? Who the hell are you? Okay, so you work with a different organization. Oh, you've met Mr. Bacon? That's nice. Yeah, yeah, something is better than nothing. Oh, maybe like Rob Thomas. Something's better than nothing, Murphy. Oh, that's not even him. Oh, what is this? Yes, it was just before the war began. Hmm. What about the secret society? Oh. At the same time, a series of bizarre murders happened all over Europe. How bizarre. All were performed in the style of a medieval execution. The victims were high-level government okay. dignitaries from each European country. Rumors of a secret society spread through the land. And various intelligence mm. agencies sprang into motion. The only clue... A sword and owl crest. A sword. A sword and owl crest. What could that mean? Oh, damn it. Who the hell is this crazy clansman? Actually, that looks like the one of the main baddies that we fought up against in Dragon Quest Heroes Blind, guys. Oh. Oh, that guy. You don't think he's crossed over to this game? Yeah, not a good type of mysterious either. Yeah, what the hell do they want? Yeah, someone from out of the blue that wants to know too. Want to be helpful? Okay. Hmm. Well, give us some guesses, you know. Yeah, we don't have any leads at all. We're just running around at this point. Going from place to place. Now we know where we gotta go. We gotta go to Florence to go get the bacon man. fortune teller in Italy, huh? Oh. Maybe we can go ahead and visit her. Maybe she'll maybe she'll hook us up. Okay. Bet you're a high paying client, if you will. Yeah, I, I really don't trust them, but if that's what we need to do, <laughs> flow, floor, whatever it is, or Florence. But yeah, if we have to mention like do a little name dropping to get some info, including this bozo's name. And we'll get there. We'll do it. We'll do what we gotta do. Save old bacon man. All right. So I think we've got everything here. We're all squared away. So let's go on and oh, actually, Thomas, you're still chilling here. What's up, buddy? 
Ah, oh, looking for old Carla. Okay. So is this the way to the world map? If I just keep running down... It is. Perfect. All the way to Florence, Italy. And we'll go ahead and check out Florence in the next episode. So guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. Like always, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't done so. Share this video with your friends. Also make sure to follow me on Twitter at ACConsular, all one word. Till next time guys, this is the Consular, and I will see ya.